let's see the response of a low pass RC circuit for a unit step function. Uh, low pass RC circuit for a unit step function. In my previous video, I have told, I have explained if uh, what will be a unit step function and what will be the Laplace transform of a unit step function. It's a uh, u of t, u of t equal to 1 uh, for t greater than or 0 and equal to 0 otherwise. This is the mathematical representation of a step function and uh, the Laplace transform of this one will be Laplace transform of a step function u of t will be u of s which is equal to 1 upon s. So this is what important it is. So because this is the input for this uh, the response we are to obtain an expression for the response of a low pass RC circuit for a unit step function. So uh, considering uh, the Laplace uh, equivalent circuit of a low pass RC circuit the Laplace equivalent it's it looks like this uh, we have a, we have resistance over here and we have a capacitance like this so input is given here r this will be 1 upon s c in Laplace domain and v v in of s v naught of s this is how uh, to represent this is the representation of a low pass RC circuit in Laplace equivalent circuit. So, uh, according to potential divider rule, according to potential divider rule, V naught will be equal to supply voltage into this impedance by total impedance. What we have is V naught of uh, S will be equal to uh, this impedance. What is that? Uh, 1 upon SC by total impedance of the circuit. This is R plus 1 by SC into the supply voltage V in of uh, S because it is in Laplace domain right it is in Laplace domain. So what happens is uh, simplifying this one what do we have is uh, uh, SC as common and cross multiplying this we will be having uh, 1 plus SRC in the, in the numerator of this function and uh, numerator 1 upon SC as it is 1 upon SC as it is. And guys uh, remember that we are uh, dealing with uh, step input, the response of a low pass RC circuit for a step input and this could be substituted with uh, 1 upon S because uh, uh, input in this case is a unit step function and the Laplace transform of unit step function is 1 upon S and so we have substituted V in with this one. Okay. So this is what it happens and uh, in this equation something is common and can be gets cancelled. This is the term which gets cancelled and guys taking out add RC as common from this term and this term 1 upon S V naught of S which is equal to 1 upon S as it is 1 upon S into uh, taking out RC as common from this one and this one what we have is RC into so we will be left with S over here S yes. and when the RC is taken out as common from here it will be by 1 by RC and 1 as it is a small modification in this one. So 1 upon 1 by RC this goes up 1 by RC into 1 upon RC this goes up I have written this in the numerator and S into S plus 1 by RC this is what it looks like. Now we have to for uh, obtaining the response of a Laplace low pass RC in its time domain we have to obtain the uh, we have to split this into its partial fractions and then we have to obtain the uh, inverse Laplace transform so that we can have the response of a low pass RC circuit in time domain. So what it is is V naught of S will be A by S plus B by S plus 1 by RC. This is the this is a standard formula like uh, this whole equation can be uh, in its partial fractions A by S plus B by S plus 1 upon RC. Okay? And uh, using partial fractions and residues method we have to evaluate the values of A and B. Again plugging back into this one we can obtain the inverse Laplace transform of this one and uh, that gives the response of A low pass RC circuit for a step input. So going going ahead A is given as A will be considering this one this circuit, this equation 1 by RC 
ओके एस इंटू एस प्लस वन बाय आर सी इंटू द रेसिड्यू ऑफ ए इंटू द रेसिड्यू ऑफ ए ओके एंड सब्जेक्टिंग एस इज इक्वल टू जीरो बिकॉज दिस वन विल बी एस इज इक्वल टू जीरो एंड दैट वन सो इन दिस एक्सप्रेशन दिस एस एंड एस गेट्स कैंसल एंड ए विल बी इक्वल टू वन अपॉन आर सी इन द न्यूमरेट राजिटीज दिस एस विल बी इक्वल टू जीरो एंड वी डोंट नीड दिस एनी मोर वी आर लेफ्ट विथ वन अपॉन आर सी सो दीज टू टर्म्स गेट्स कैंसिल एंड वील बी लेफ्ट विथ वन ओके एंड बी विल बी इक्वल टू गेटिंग बैक टू दिस एक्सप्रेशन या दिस वन getting back to this expression we have uh, uh, 1 by rc as it is in the numerator s into s plus 1 by rc sorry 1 by rc guys and uh, the residue of b into residue of b which is equal to s plus 1 by rc and subjecting s is equal to minus 1 upon rc because this will be equal to 0 and this gives rise to s is equal to minus 1 by rc according to uh, partial fractions according to the rule in one of the rule in the partial fractions and you can clearly see this this term and this term gets cancelled and plugging in the value of s is equal to minus 1 by so b will be equal to 1 by rc as it is in the numerator s will be substituted with this value minus 1 by rc Which will result in minus one. Okay, this is the value for b. This is the value for b. This is the value for a. Plugging in these values back over here. I'll do it over here, guys. Ah, uh, please don't mind. Because ah, uh, this I guess you will be taking it. So v not of s, v not of s will be equal to what is the value of a? We obtain as one and s as it is plus. Even b, we had uh, now minus one by s plus one by r c. Okay, so uh, this will be, and in this case, uh, the inverse Laplace transform of one by s will be one. Uh, v not of uh, t, which is the inverse Laplace transform of this one, the inverse Laplace transform of one by s will be one, and minus uh, the inverse Laplace transform of one uh, by s plus one by r c will be e raised to. This is positive, and so we'll be having negative t by r c. Okay. Now this is the expression for the response of a low pass R C circuit for a unit step function. And how it looks like is uh, considering this may be the input. This may be the input with amplitude one and t on this axis tending to infinity. Okay. So this is a uh, u of t. u of t of over this side and how would be the output will be guys at t equal to 0 at t equal to 0 at t equal to 0 so t equal to 0 over here so t equal to 0 this will be this entire equation will be 0 and e raised to 0 will be 1 and 1 minus 1 will be 0 so the output starts from here it is exponential it will be increasing exponentially and guys what happens is as t tends to infinity as t tends to infinity this will be e raised to minus infinity which will be zero as t tends to infinity this will be uh, minus infinity and e raised to minus infinity will be zero and we will be left with one and so the response will be matching the input as t tends to infinity this is the response of a unit this is the response of a low pass rc circuit for a unit step function this is what it happens